Hi and welcome. This is Gazwan Kari over at SharePointQuester.com. Today we'll be removing alerts for a specific user from a web application using Windows PowerShell. Uh, to do so, I went to my SharePoint, uh, one of the SharePoint site collections that lives under my web application, and uh, I'm just going to show you. And that's actually the only site collection where I have alerts set up. Uh, let's drill down into a specific user here, uh, Rob Jacobs, and let's get a list of all the. Uh, alerts he has set up on the system and he's got alerts on three different lists so I'm gonna run a script uh, to get rid of these alerts and the script what it's gonna do is gonna generate back the IDs of the alerts it removes uh, from SharePoint so let me copy the script here and let's uh, paste it and the the web application is SharePoint 2010 so I'm not gonna change the web application name here the user is uh, R Jacobs so I'm gonna change this to R Jacobs, R. Jacobs, and uh, that's all I need to change. So let me grab all this now, and let's switch back in here into Management Shell. Let me start it up fresh. So I'm going to right-click on SharePoint 2010 Management Shell, and I'm going to paste my script in here. So I'm going to click Edit, Paste, and then a couple of enters, and notice that three IDs have been generated for what has been removed from SharePoint so let me go back and I just need to refresh this let me go back to again site settings user alerts exact same site and you don't actually see Rob Jacobs in here anymore so these alerts have been removed for that specific user on this web application all the site collections all the subsites within that web application in my case there was only three IDs that were removed three alerts that he had set up against that web application so this is how we remove alerts for a specific user from a web application. This concludes this recording. Thanks for tuning in.